The old cliche when someone is putting up numbers like Caden Holmes is, is that they're putting up video game numbers. Well, I don't think you could even put these numbers up on your Xbox or PlayStation. Through three games, Holmes has thrown for over 1,000 yards and has 21 total touchdowns. And just staying focused on practices, it helps a lot. My mindset is just doing whatever I can do. It's just trying to stay um, healthy and get the win. He's a defensive coordinator nightmare, and uh, we're lucky to have him on our football team because, you know, Caden would give me fits trying to be able to contain him. I mean, it's like kind of pick your poison. He burst onto the scene last year, but this year he has taken another step in his development as a quarterback, something that is a very scary proposition for opponents. Well, last year I did a, lot of, did a lot of it on my feet, but this year I'm trying to show that I can throw the ball, stay in the pocket, and deliver a good pass. Just reading the defenses, that's what I'm working on right now. Just trying to know where the defense is going to be before I say go on the play and know where I'm going to throw the ball. Nothing surprises me with his ability. Throwing left-handed, uh, running, just anything he wants to do, he does it so effortless. You know, it's just he just doesn't look like he's even trying and he's hitting the juke stick to, you know, break someone's ankles when he's running the ball or just sidearming, you know, throwing the ball and it's it's on point and it's perfect. So uh, it's just we're, we're getting used to it. We're not in all like we used to be. So, um, you know, it's it's what we expect from him. Last week against Clay, he threw for 274 yards and six touchdowns, and that made this a pretty easy decision. Caden Holmes from Fremont Ross is our athlete of the week.